An orange man accused of killing his mother just sobs in court today. Tonight, we're learning more about him. Police say he called 911 saying, quote, I killed her, I stabbed her. Hi, everyone. I'm Ann Craig. I'm Ann Nyberg. Darren has a night off. 22-year-old Timothy Granada is accused of killing his mother, 58-year-old Claudia Deenan Granada, and then calling 911 to say he had just committed a murder. Police found him walking away from the crime scene holding a Bible and a cell phone with blood on his clothing. And tonight we're learning that Timothy has a history of mental health issues. His attorney says he met with the accused and his father before court today and says the entire family is just devastated by what happened. News 8's Stephanie Simone is live tonight in Orange. She has more on these new developments. Stephanie? Yeah, and details are starting to surface about this case. And like you said, police here in Orange said that he admitted to this murder. Now, his attorney says that Granada needs psychiatric help. But in court today, he also talked about his previous education and lack of prior history with the department. Much of his time in court, 22-year-old Timothy Granada cannot hold back tears. He, is, uh, he was in Lehigh University. Standing in front of a judge accused of killing his 58-year-old mother, Dr. Claudia Dinan Granada. His attorney met with Timothy and his father before court. It's absolutely destroyed this family. Police pulled boxes of evidence from the home today. They say he beat and stabbed his mother. The injuries were to the head, neck, torso and extremities. Police say family members called 911 from the home and so did Timothy, but it was too late. Police say they caught up with Granada down the road from the home when he told them, quote, I killed her, I stabbed her. He's, dev he's devastated. It's just, it's a horrible, horrible, devastating situation. You can't imagine uh, anybody having, you know, to go through this. One of four, Granada graduated from Hopkins School, attended Lehigh University, where his attorney says he wrestled and wanted to study religion. Now his attorney asked him to be placed in a guarded psychiatric facility because of his mental health history. I'm not sure exactly what the details are, what the exact diagnosis is. Uh, there's some uh, indication uh, that uh, he had a hospitalization at one time, and we have, certainly have to get those records and, and explore that. The family is making funeral arrangements. Now he's being held on a $2 million bond. Now, his attorney said in court today that he does not know of any medications that Granada is on right now or if he is ordered to take any sort of medications. In court today, he was ordered to a psych evaluation. Right now, he is scheduled to be back in court on August 5th. We're live in Orange tonight. Stephanie Simone, News 8.